Welcome to this special celebratory documentary to honor the 2020 Pritzker Architecture Prize laureates, Yvonne Farrell and Shelley McNamara. Welcome and good morning. Each year, the Pritzker Architecture Prize Ceremony is presented in a special venue, in a building and in a city that helps us celebrate the achievements of architecture and the ideals of the prize. This is the first time in our 42-year history in which the site for the prize is not the built work of a building, but rather the built work of modern technology. Some may feel that's appropriate. Personally, I wish it was otherwise. While the pandemic has kept us from celebrating architecture in a great building, it has affirmed the enduring principles and ideas of architecture. In a way, the pandemic has affirmed the importance of the human as a social being. The prize is based on the notion that architecture should serve the people for whom the work is built. It should meet their needs for firmness, commodity, and delight. It's fitting, therefore, that this year's laureates, Yvonne Farrell and Shelley McNamara, have first and foremost demonstrated that friendship, socialization, and partnership are the wellspring for the humane ideals to which their built work is dedicated. May I send my warmest congratulations to Yvonne Farrell and Shelley McNamara of Grafton Architects on their wonderful achievement in winning the prestigious Pritzker Architecture Prize. As laureates of the Pritzker Prize, you have been accorded the highest accolade within your profession, having joined an illustrious list of practitioners of your craft, fellow Pritzker laureates. The Pritzker Prize provides recognition to those who shape the built environment, thus our lives, for the better. And it also calls attention throughout the world to the architectural discipline itself. Its presence explains to those millions who are not architects why they should pay attention to architecture and help to see that it thrives. In this film, you will see some of the work of these two great architects, Yvonne Farrell and Shelley McNamara. You will hear their words. They well deserve the Pritzker Prize. They have had a remarkable, productive career, which, luckily for us, will continue. Architecture is an ancient art, which needs each of us to continue and transform it. Being an architect means that we add to the crust of this fragile planet. We need to add beauty and be efficient with the resources we specify. Materials in closed spaces shelter our physical and psychological selves. Materials from the earth form our palette, from which we need to choose carefully. Recently, I was asked to write a letter to a young architect. And as we stand here in the long room in Trinity, I send this gibbron arrow as a letter to the future. There are many different types of architects. Become the best that you yourself might be. The world is a beautiful and amazing place. Look around you and see how wonderful the ordinary is. You are privileged by being trained as an architect. Share it. Give of your talent and time, enrich society by being you. People rely on you to transform their needs and dreams into actual space. Do your best. Standing here almost alone in this room, celebrating this wonderful honor of the Pritzker Prize with no audience, brings to mind the empty stage of a Samuel Beckett play. But of course we are not alone. We are in a space which holds time and knowledge and treasures of the mind. We can feel the presences of all the great people who passed through this great space. We chose this room so that we could celebrate the power of architecture here in our own city. 
so that we would feel part of a bigger order, which of course is one of the functions of architecture. We are going forward, not backwards, to a time of Alberti, the great 15th century humanist, who saw architecture as the infrastructure of civilized life. The first principles of architecture are becoming once again the first principles of architecture. This crisis of climate change and pandemic makes us think about the free gifts of nature, of light, of air, water, sun, wind, shade, earth, and plants. These are our resources, our materials as architect, and they demand respect, care, and love. Congratulations, Shelley and Yvonne. Welcome to our very special family. Congratulations, Shelley and Yvonne. My heartiest congratulations, Yvonne and Shelley. Shelly-san, Yvonne-san, Domo, Benetongo, Zaymas. My most sincere felicitations to Yvonne and Shelly. Thank you for your time, Shelly and Yvonne. The simple, unique, and unique design of the design has Parabéns, Shelley e Ivone. Felicitações, Shelley e Ivone. Congratulazioni, Ivone e Shelley. Bravissima. Queridas Yvonne y Shelly, felicitaciones. Congratulations. Hola, Shelly san, Yvonne san. Congratulations. Congratulations, Shelly and Yvonne a great acknowledgement of your fine work. Parabéns pelo Prêmio Prisca, Sheila e Yvonne. Parabéns. Congratulations, Shelley and Yvonne. Bravo, bravo, dear Yvonne and dear Shelley. And bravo to Grafton as a team for winning this year's prestigious Pritzker Architecture Prize. Congratulations to Shelley and Yvonne. Shelley and Yvonne, congratulations, hearty congratulations. Shelly san, Yvonne san, omedetou gozaimasu. Felicitations, Shelly and Yvonne. Congratulations, Yvonne and Shelley. Welcome to the Pritzker Prize family. Shelley, Yvonne, uh, parabéns pelo merecidíssimo prêmio Pritzker 2020.
Shelly and Yvonne, congratulations. Congratulations, Shelly and Yvonne. Well deserved. Congratulations, Shelly and Yvonne. Um, real accomplishment. Congratulations, Shelly and Yvonne. Shelly, Yvonne, congratulations, complimenti, bravi, bravissimi. Congratulations, Shelly, Yvonne. Felicitats, Xili. Felicitats, Yvonne. Felicitats a totes dues. <laughs>